Did you say you called his sister I did. and impersonated a nurse from a hospital and got medical information? I did. And you found out that because Dylan has aller allergies to animals? That's what Dylan had said to me through a text, yes. Because you and Dylan had hooked up on a website. Right. And he told you some things that you found are also on Daniel's website. Correct. Which went back to the archives and found Correct. some things. Correct. That went like, back about a year are ago. Are you like a detective or something? No, I'm not. I'm not. I just, I just pay attention to detail. Do you have allergies to animals? When I was a kid, I did. I don't know. Yeah. And, and so you think because of that, mm -hmm. that commonality means they're the same person? Not just that, no. One of the other similarities is Dylan used to text me, and I had made a comment one time, and I had said, um, I said, yeah, when the chips are down, who's going to be around? And, he, and Dylan says, oh, I love that quote. And I thought that was a little odd to use the word quote. Well, sure enough, I go back and look at Daniel's, some of his Twitter, and he loves quotes. Okay, so it's, it's really hard for me to believe <laughs> that this is all, this is a different person. Oh, wow. Very hard. And how did you find out about Courtney? Well, through the Facebook. And uh, we spoke, and I told her, I said, listen, honey, I am sorry. I don't, I don't mean to burst your bubble, but this guy is not real. And she was, she was devastated. How did you find okay. Daniel? I did an internet search on but Dylan. But all you had was Dylan's pic. You had Dylan's name and no, Daniel's I had, picture. Right, when, I, when I did Dylan's name, his picture comes up. So that's how uh, I. But how'd you, know, you find out the picture? They share the same last name. Right, on the they Facebook. share the same na last name. Exactly. Uh -huh. Exactly. Well, wouldn't he be kind of a dumb catfish to use his own last name? <laughs> you know, absolutely. You would think so. It's just, it's like, how in the world, you know, do they have the same verbiage? Do they have the same likes? Do they have the same health issue? I mean, that's just like one in a million shots. Did, did you contact now, his girlfriend? I did. But that seems really vengeful. You contacted his girlfriend? I don't think it was vengeful at all. I just think it was doing the right thing. You actually also claimed that you were in an intimate relationship with me and claimed, I no. and claimed Dr. Phil has the emails that you sent to her. Okay. Either you or Ron, whoever okay, actually fine. sent them. Mm -hmm. yeah. But claimed to know certain intimate details that well, you would know if you were in an intimate relationship okay. with me. Well, yeah. obviously I wasn't in an intimate relationship because yeah. I never met him, but these are yeah. things he told me. Okay, these are things he told me. Well, you okay. described body parts. These are things he told me. <laughs> and I wanted to be very specific with her. I well, did. Well, you were very specific. I was, yeah. absolutely. <laughs> I sure was. They weren't accurate for the record. They were not accurate? <laughs> Which well. my girlfriend would immediately know. Well, this is like, okay, again, you, you again. Say, you shouldn't do that when you say that. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>